Was until Christmas and hours before people leave to see loved ones, many made a mad dash to get free COVID tests. Well, I came for a free uh, kit for COVID testing and um, found out that uh, the kits were gone within about five minutes. Mike Crick and dozens of other people got turned away at Guilford County Health Department on Maple Street in Greensboro. We'll probably go and try the, the pharmacies and see if we can get, um, you know, I know you're going to pay for it there, but um, at least you can get it. This is a look at vehicles lining the street and wrapping around the corner before the 2 p.m. giveaway. Every driver hoping to get up to four of the 500 tests available. That's a match they've given out today, and I was glad to get them. This is very good. I really like this. Even though I'm fully vaccinated, I still want to be safe. Making testing convenient is a priority for Guilford County Health Director Yulia Van. We're trying to make it as easy for people to get tested. There are so many different testing opportunities out there, but I know that people make it may feel more comfortable sometimes to do it in the privacy and their comfort of their own home. So that is this is just another opportunity. Testing in Guilford County has increased ahead of the holidays. Yeah. Monday, Health Department staff tested more than 200 patients in Greensboro. It's critical as cases go up and people are turning to health care facilities for help. Absolutely. Very concerned about the fact that we are up in our hospitalizations. Um, we are at 106 individuals that are hospitalized in our health care systems as of yesterday. We're uh, waiting to receive the numbers for today from our partners. Those numbers have not been seen in Guilford County since beginning of October.